when we solve any electrical circuit using mesh analysis or uh, kirchhoff's voltage law we often use the terms loop current and branch current so do you know what is the difference between a loop current and a branch current hi i am shilpa sambhi so let's together understand the basic difference between a loop current and the branch current so what is a loop current basically loop current is a hypothetical current it is an imaginary current which is assumed by us to uh, use kirchhoff's voltage law or the mesh analysis we assume that there is some current which is flowing within that particular loop so that is just an imaginary current now what is a branch current branch current is the actual current which is flowing through the branches through that particular element it could be a resistor it could be a capacitor it could be an inductor or any other circuit element so if you take up this particular uh, example here there is a small circuit so you need to guess that what uh, which one of them is the loop current and which of them is representing the branch current so as you can see in this particular circuit the ones uh, which are marked as i1 and i2 these are the loop currents which are imagined by us okay this is an imaginary current it's an hypothetical current but ia ic and ib these are the actual currents which are flowing through the uh, circuit elements and these are known as the branch currents so if we just try to make a relation between these loop currents and the branch currents uh, you may find that ia is the branch current which is flowing through the circuit element uh, this 5 volt voltage source and this 10 ohm resistor and there is a loop current i1 which is flowing through it so if you just closely observe this particular loop here uh, ia will be equal to i1 in the same way if we take up this branch which is consisting of this 15 ohm resistor here and this 7 volt uh, voltage source here so that we have imagined a loop current of i2 but the branch current is ic so ic is equal to i2 now there is one more branch current which is left and that is the middle branch which is represented by ib here now this ib is experiencing both the loop currents from uh, the left hand uh, side loop it is experiencing the current i1 from the right hand side loop it is experiencing the current i2 so ultimately the direction of i i1 is like this i2 is like this and because both are uh, having the opposite directions so we have to take the difference of the two currents if we assume that i1 is greater than i2 then ib will be equal to i1 minus i2 okay so these are the relationships between the loop current and the branch current but do remember that loop currents are only the hypothetical currents which are assumed for our uh, analysis to uh, you know make up the equations for the mesh analysis or the kirchhoff's voltage law but the actual current which is flowing through the circuit elements is the branch current which is represented here by ia ib and ic so i hope that uh, by this point you have understood the difference between the loop current and the branch current so do follow us for more such videos and concepts till then thank you and happy learning